Hi, and welcome to Cooking with Carl. A simple man with a simple plan. Right, thanks for joining me guys. Again, it's Cooking with Carl and we're going to be looking at budgeting stuff. And I've been bargaining ba 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 right. I've been bargain hunting and I found some sea bass. Yes, steelheads for you in America. Sea bass, yeah, brilliant. And at a bargain price. Oh, and some other stuff which I'll show you in a minute. Quick, simple, easy meal, and you don't have to eat total rubbish when you're on a budget. So let's crack on. I'll show you what I'm doing, how to cook it, and what I've got else. Here we go. Right, so I've been bargain hunting. I've got some spring onions for 13p. I've had quite a few of them because I had a cheese sandwich earlier for my lunch. <laughs> and potato cakes. Oh, so, 32p. Right, half price. But I'm going to use a couple of them with my sea bass. Yeah, this is the best one I've got. I think it's been double reduced. So I don't know what the actual full price was, probably about three and a half quid. Uh, maybe four. But it's been reduced twice as you see that reduced label stuck on top of the other one. And that one's saying it was two eighty five. It was probably about three and a half quid. And I got it at one pound fourteen. Bargain! So for less than two quid, I want to have a nice tidy little meal and tasty. You're just going to get out there and bargain on guys. Right, next thing I'll show you, it'll be in the pan. Right, so we've got the old steel head sea bass cooking in there with the potato cakes and spring onion. What I didn't show in the video of uh, on on the skin side of the sea bass, what I've done, I put some fine cuts in it and then added a load of sea salt. Cause I like crispy skin. And that's the way to get the crispy skin. Hey, do you like my new frying pan? Linda said my old frying pan was shit and I needed a new one. So she got me this. Ah, it's a default. It's mega. I love it. So, we'll give these a couple of minutes with the skin uh, <coughs> cooking first with the salt to get crispy and then flip it and then it'll be ready. Don't take long, you don't need to over fry it, don't overcook it. Just blast it on heat, on each side, about three minutes each side sorted. Hey, I tell you what, if you like fish, I've discovered this. Oh, I had it found for me by Linda. Uh, Tesco mackerel in curry sauce. But she gets it from, uh, not direct from Tesco's, it's like a, a company shop type thing where they get stuff that that's end of the range and they're not selling and they sell them off cheap, so... Oh, I've got shitloads of these, and I can eat this out of the tin. It's bloody gorgeous. I remember, like, in uh, when I were in Germany, they love all stuff like that. Roll mop herring and, like, curry sauce, and, oh, <laughs> yeah, happy days. Love it. But, right, I'll bring you back uh, when it's plated up, and this is, oh, proper lush. See, you don't have to earned a fortune to have sea bass this in this pan costs less than two quid and, and there we go I've just flipped it so you can see the skin upside now look I flip the potato cakes so literally a couple of minutes now 
I took it back over and then let me play it up. Bloody gorgeous. And there we go. The finished meal. Let's try a bit of this. Mmm, mmm. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah, so that's a meal. It looks posh. But that costs less than two quid. Just use a bit of imagination and do a bit of bargain hunting. Cheers guys. Catch you on the next one.